Scientists think that the early solar system was a chaotic place, with planetesimals, asteroids, and comets colliding and bombarding Earth, the Moon, and other inner planets. Now, NASA's Hubble Space Telescope has captured something similar happening in another planetary system around the star Fomalhaut. Astronomers spotted a new point of light in an exoplanetary system that wasn't there in earlier Hubble images. This new observation suggests a violent collision between two large objects, creating a massive debris cloud, something we don't see in our solar system today, but was likely in its past. Fomalhaut, located just 25 light years from Earth, is one of the brightest stars in the night sky. It's larger and brighter than the sun and surrounded by several rings of dusty debris. In 2008, Hubble detected what seemed to be an exoplanet, Fomalhaut b, the first discovered in visible light. However, it faded over time, leading scientists to conclude that it was a dust cloud from colliding planetesimals. While searching for it in recent Hubble images, they found another unexpected point of light in a similar spot. They named the original object CS1 and the new one CS2. Collisions like these play a key role in shaping planetary systems but they're rare and hard to study. This discovery gives astronomers a unique chance to estimate both the size and number of colliding objects in Fomalhaut's debris disk, something that's nearly impossible to do otherwise. They estimate the objects that formed CS1 and CS2 were about 18 miles, with roughly 300 million similar bodies orbiting in the system. Using Hubble, Astronomers will monitor CS2 over the next three years to see if it fades or brightens. The team also hopes to use NASA's James Webb Space Telescope to extend their observations into longer infrared wavelengths of light, complementing the visible wavelengths of their Hubble data. Multispectral observations of the Fomalhaut system would provide a more complete picture of its rapid evolution giving astronomers a rare opportunity to study how colliding planetesimals behave while revealing insights into their composition and formation. This research also offers hints of what our own solar system was like billions of years ago.